positioning hatch origin. Now that we know how to hatch, maybe we want to change the origin at which the hatch controls itself. So let's go ahead and create a simple square or a rectangle. Now let's go ahead and activate hatch. And let's add a hatch that we may want to change the origin of. A common one for me would be bricks. I'll go ahead and pick this one here. I'll select this area. And as you can see, it's white. So let's change the scaling of this a bit. I'll go ahead and put the angle to 0. Change the scaling to 0.5 to see what happens with that. And it's looking a lot better. Let's go ahead and change it a lot smaller. 0 0.05 tab. And there you go. Now we got some nice looking bricks. Let's go ahead and hit escape to deselect. Or you can hit close. Let's come down here to this bottom corner. If I zoom in a bit, as you can see, this bottom brick here isn't quite the right size as all the rest of them. And typically, if you want your design to look a little more realistic, you'll want your bottom brick to be the correct size. So let's go ahead and do that. Well, we can do that by first selecting our hatch. And the fastest way to really do this would be to hover over this grip here in the middle. And you have these options, stretch, origin point, hatch angle, and scale. This allows you to change your hatch a little more faster on the fly. So let's go ahead and try that. We'll go ahead and hover over it and select origin point. Now I'll go ahead and since I have no object snaps turned on right now, I will shift right click and select end point and I'll move my hatch down to the bottom. And then I'll press enter. I'll make sure that I exit out of the hatch command I'll zoom in again. Now the bricks look like they're laid properly. Before we had half of a brick as our first brick for our foundation. Now if I come zoom out a bit, come up, that bottom brick that we had before is on the top up here. But that's okay. What we were mainly focusing on was this bottom brick here to make sure the hatch lined up pro properly the way we wanted it to. I'll go ahead and zoom out, pan over to the side, and there you go. We learned how to set the origin for our hatch.